Oh my god. <laughs> Good morning, how are you? Good, how are you? Hello, Joe. Hey, babe, I like this. Yeah, that's nice. I like that a lot. Um, they've got a lot of games in here. Yeah. And they're towards the um, bottom. Is this open? Yeah. Right there. Oh, oh, oh yeah. yeah. Um, I think she wanted 10 for that. Okay. We need to replace the bathroom canvases. Yeah, that's nice. It Look. looks more like... Are you getting stuff or no? Yeah, I think I'm going to get some stuff. Okay, hold on. Oh, that's our Okay. What about these for the basement? These are like four pillows? Yeah. Yeah. What's what? $7 and whatever that is. Do you have any of the systems for the video games? I don't have a system. Okay. No. Yeah. What are you asking on them? Well, they're a dollar piece. Dollar piece, okay. I've got three of these. Would you do eight on the picture? Cute. Okay, I owe you 11 bucks. Wait, nope, you don't. Oh, I owe you more. Uh, plus three. 14. 14. Yeah. <laughs> there you go, sir. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very much. Off as a fundraiser cool. kind of thing for animals. Yeah. So, um, goodness. Um, how about 30 for all three? 30 bucks? Mm -hmm. I'll do that. That's fine. Okay, that many needs to be kept separate because it's for the animals. Yeah. Can you put it in a, in a baggie? Yeah, I'll go. There you go. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Sure. You guys having a garage sale? Yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. My bad. I saw your sign on the street. We detoured in. Yeah. How are you guys? Good. How are you doing? Good, good. Yeah, everything's a mess right now. So That's all right. Okay. Appreciate you letting us look. Darcy wanted a treasure box. Oh, that's cool. For her jewelry. Yep. <gasps> and it's a jewelry. <gasps> Has jewelry in it. <laughs> Sorry, now I can't negotiate. <laughs> You've showed your hand. She asked for it. Any of your baseball gear for sale? No, so nothing past like the, the covered stuff. Yeah, the, gotcha. the famous in the picture for sale. How much are the uh, posters and stuff? So the Marilyn Monroe ones are fifty each. These are like maybe like five bucks. Okay. How much the, for this? The big Marilyn ones, not the little one. The little ones. Gotcha. Oh, Ten. What if it's for an adorable five-year-old girl who specifically asked for this? <laughs> <laughs> Would you go eight? Yeah. Yay! It's going to make her day. <laughs> How do you open your card case? Um, it's kind of funny. He's got a, so the case itself's not for sale, but all the cards are. Okay, what are you asking for him? Um, I was going to sell them individually. Okay, but... Where if you make an offer for all of them, I may just send that. Okay. And how much are your CDs? Um, CDs, like, I'd say a dollar each. Okay. Is the back one blocked in? Yeah, yeah. I do photography. We get married um, in April. Oh, cool. Congrats. Congrats. Oh my god. Steve O. And look, he signed it. Where did you meet Steve O? At the Funny Bone. The Funny Bone? That's hilarious. Alright, I'm gonna set this up over here. Okay. Thanks for letting 
good. Yeah, thank you. Um, are you done? Yeah. Okay, what do you want for your shirt and your jacket? Seven bucks. Okay. Autograph one. I think I'll pass on the jacket, but I'll do the shirt. So I owe you seven and eight is fifteen plus another five is twenty. That worked out nice and easy. Yeah. There you go. Awesome. Thanks, brother. Thank you very much. Good luck with the wedding. Yeah, thank you so much. Oh, that's your chair. I don't know if that's the kind of right. chairs you're wanting or not. Good morning. I see that. <laughs> yeah. Those are awesome. Are they from an old stroller? Yeah, we think so. Yeah, but not sure. We bought them at a vintage. Yeah, that's neat. Yeah. Huh. One of them's missing the, the but, yeah. cover thing. Nice. I'm gonna buy them. I like them. Yay. I'm gonna get your table here too. Okay. I'll keep shopping and just pay all at once because okay. I might find yeah, some we'll stuff. Yeah, we'll set it aside over here. Oh, thank you. Oh, careful. <laughs> You're gonna hurry. You can just set it over here. Yeah, sure. You sure thank you. you don't want to celebrate oh. America <laughs> on the fourth <laughs> right <of my laughs> weekend? Come on. <laughs> you asking 25 cents on that? Is that yeah. right? Yeah. I'll take that for a quarter. Yeah. Yeah. Go wrong. No, looks like, like my so wife. You is, like all my vintage, I, I do have, like all the vintage you know what? stuff. I have, that, I, have, I have a camera I was just about to bring down. Or a clock. Oh, yeah? Yeah. The clock that folds down, you know, and opens up. Okay. Like one of those old clocks. Yeah, like the little like nightstand ones. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'll take a look it. at it. You got some stuff? What it? Do you have a price on these? Um, uh, that's his. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, and they're in the... yeah. So this is a clock. I've yeah. seen these. Yeah, that is cool. This one. Very nice. So oh, you got a little uh, binoculars too. Yeah. Just here. Is this a? Oh, the light bulb? Yeah, it's, I can't. I used to just have it on like a spring from an old mattress. And yeah. Isn't that cool? It is cool. Right? Um, the, these little binoculars and the light bulb, what would you need? Six? Sure. Okay. And then I've got, he said $2 on this. On that? Yep. So we're up to eight. Okay. And then let's see, 18 on the wheels is 26. Okay. Another five for the table is 31. And a quarter for the clock is thirty-one twenty-five. Okay, thirty-one. Here's, here's thirty-two. Don't worry about the change. Yeah. Oh, thank you. No, no, no problem. Okay, great. Thank, thank you so much. Here. All right, guys, I'm back at the shop. We didn't go to that many sales today because it's July Fourth weekend, so there really weren't that many sales to go to. But the ones we did go to, we found some really good stuff. I got it all pulled out. I'm gonna show you what we found. One sale we went to had a lot of cool vintage stuff. Um, so I got these four wheels. They're by Hedstrom, and I thought they were maybe for like a little doll, uh, like bassinet type thing. Not a bassinet, a stroller, like a carriage, uh, when I was Googling them. But it's actually for um, an actual uh, baby carriage, an old baby carriage from probably the 50s or 60s, if I had to guess. I paid 18 for all four. This one doesn't have the hubcap, um, and I think I might just like display that on the wall leading up to the shop because I'm putting all kinds of vintage stuff on the wall. And then the other three I'll just list individually for probably about $20 each. 
Got this vintage uh, GE uh, mantle clock for a quarter. Not sure if it works, but for that price, I'll put it in the shop for three or four bucks. Got these cool binoculars. Uh, these pop open. If I remember, I think these were like $3. I got like these and this bulb for six, I'm pretty sure. And I just thought this thing was awesome. Just a huge old light bulb. I got four three packs of filters on one sale for a dollar each. Anytime I find these and there's a decent quantity of them, I go ahead and buy them. Like if it was just one, I probably wouldn't have messed with it because it would maybe sell for seven or eight bucks on eBay. But I can combine the four and probably get 25 bucks, I think. Got some video games at one sale for a dollar each. Super Mario Strikers, Robots, and Harry Potter Goblet of Fire. I haven't looked these two up. I knew this one was kind of special, but unfortunately the disc is like really cracked. I mean, you can see that huge crack in there. There's no way that's gonna work and it's not even repairable, unfortunately. However, I can still sell the case. I saw the case alone for that going for about 30 bucks. We stumbled across a bonus sale uh, where Whitney got a jewelry box for Darcy and I got this ridiculous Steve-O shirt. And he actually had a sign. He said he saw him at the Funny Bone uh, Comedy Club. Got this killer ACDC poster. I can't decide if I want to keep this or sell it because it is pretty awesome. It's got all of the album artwork down here. That is just, I mean, it's it's framed and everything. So I'm, I'm really tempted to keep that. I think my best find of the day were these old Matchbox cars. There's three cases of them and I got them all for 30 bucks and I only just kind of briefly glanced at them. So we're gonna open these up and take a closer look. The condition on these actually looks really good uh, for vintage cars. Like a lot of times the paint's just like totally gone, but these look super clean. If you guys have never dealt with these vintage cars, definitely keep an eye out for them. The years are almost always stamped on the bottom. Like this one's from 76. Yeah, look how clean that is. I mean, it, these look brand new. Most of the time when I get lots like these, I will individually list the ones that I think, you know, will bring 15, 20 bucks or more uh, on their own. And then I'll just do an auction lot for a lot of the rest of ones. Like I'll, you know, group up 20, 30 cars together. Here's a Hot Wheels. That's from 82, I think. Another tip for you guys, Hot Wheels, a lot of the vintage cars have red uh, circles on the tires and they call those red lines. Uh, those can definitely have some better value. So that's something to keep an eye out for. I didn't look in this lot specifically for any red lines, but hopefully there's a few in here. Here's an old Volkswagen Beetle, that's cool. Let's see, that is, it says Siru, S-I-R-U, made in West Germany, that's pretty cool. Here's an old Frito-Lay truck by Tomika. Yeah, I am really happy with this lot. Considering I barely looked at it, I think I got really lucky. So here's a 1973 Piston Popper Mach 1 by Matchbox. Yeah, there are some really cool cars in here. So it doesn't look like there's any red lines in here, but that's okay. Um, I do think these cars are gonna do pretty well. I'll do probably lots of like 25 or 30 and I'm gonna auction them off. I'll probably start them all at every auction like a dollar each just to gain a lot of interest and I think they'll probably bring close to a dollar a car, if not more, at auction being in this condition. So I think altogether I should get between $100 and $200 for these. That is it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.